I believe that ultimately there may be some ageism that could happen that a woman would deal with more than a man. You think about uh, male journalists, it's usually the nerdy guy with glasses, gray hair, you know. Um, but women, well, there's a couple things, and I've actually been kind of conscious of this. Being a woman who writes about music and specifically rock and roll, you know, you never want to be perceived as a groupie, for one. I'll tell you a funny story. Um, I have interviewed some amazing musicians in my career. I mean, I'm honored. The list is pretty incredible, actually. And I've, but some of them I've been a fan of. But many times I've thought, oh, I'd love to take a picture with them. And I've passed because I didn't want to appear like a groupie. Uh, a couple of people that I'll just mention would be Keith Richards, um, Johnny Rotten. So funny enough, though, a couple years back, I interviewed Jimmy Page. I don't know if you saw it. Well, yeah. Okay, I'll just... So funny enough, I interviewed Jimmy Page and Jack White for a documentary uh, called It Might Get Loud about guitar playing. And I had seen before my interview, someone else had gone in and they had taken a picture with Jimmy. And I thought, wow, this is Jimmy Page. This is like my one chance. But you know, I'm this professional journalist. I don't want to be perceived, especially because I'm a woman, yada, yada. And I just went, forget it. So after the interview, I have said, I never do this. So I want you to know that, uh, you know, this is really rare. And it was funny, Jack White made a, a joke like, oh, well, we feel, you know, we're honored. You know, I don't know if he was being sarcastic. But bottom line is that I think that as a woman, you'd have to be a little more concerned with that. I want to be taken seriously, you know.